What's better than a duck? A duck three times the size of an elephant. Shantungosaurus is one of those animals that's so incredibly majestic that it doesn't quite seem real. It's one of the largest terrestrial animals of all time, and perhaps the most massive non-sauropod dinosaur. While China has revealed more than its fair share of beautiful and unique fossils, especially in recent years, Shantungosaurus stands head and shoulders above the crowd. Mighty Duck lived in Late Cretaceous China, in what is now the Shandong province. Five incomplete skeletons were discovered in 1973, all of varying sizes. Several specimens were briefly assigned to the now invalid Zushangosaurus, but later revealed to simply be growth stages of Shantungosaurus. Kind of awkward, but it happens. You can ask Jack Horner about it. And no, this video's title isn't clickbait. Shantungosaurus holds the distinction of being the largest biped known to science, extinct or otherwise. There's some possible exceptions with the biggest Edmontosaurus specimens, but right now, Uncle Scrooge seems like a solid bet for top dog. Its upper bounds as far as size goes range between 14 and 15 or higher meters, with a mass of up to 16 tons. That's 135 Dwayne Johnsons. That's 10.6 adult hippos. That's 1.6 Sues. Yep, you heard me right. This dark-winged duck was more than half again as large as one of the biggest specimens of T-Rex. It may very well represent the biomechanical limit for bipeds. Does that mean we'll find a 16-ton theropod one day? Well, probably not. Theropods like T-Rex are obligate bipeds, but Shantungosaurus and other giant hadrosaurs were low-slung and could use their forelimbs when needed to support their huge bodies. I'm not saying it's impossible. We used to think that Pteranodon was the limit for flying animals after all, and the hugest archids are twice as big. But don't hold your breath. Speaking of huge predators, Shantungosaurus was essentially immune to them. It was so much bigger than Zushin Tyrannus, the four-ton Tyrannosaur it rubbed elbows with, that once it reached adult size, it wouldn't need to worry about predation at all. It lived alongside a plethora of other incredible animals, including the all-powerful Micropachycephalosaurus, and even today inspires us with its majestic glory. Don't mess with the ducks, man. They'll mess back.